to express the feelings pulsating from their heart, wishing for your sweet nectar to once again be a part. As the heat of their desire throbs from sun to sun, Welcome to the Actual Facts Tarot. I am Goddess Hatet Horaretet, and this is a general love reading for my Libra. Sun, Moon, Rising, Jupiter, and Venus. Libra, my darling. Thank you for stopping by and coming to visit me today. Now don't you forget to hit that like, share, and subscribe to my page. Now you can hit the bell notifier to know when I will be uploading more of your videos, Libra, okay? Now, uh, Libra, you have to excuse me for speaking so low, but it's after 3 o'clock in the morning. And you're the last reading that I did, my darling, okay? Just finished, uh, doing other readings. Um... <clears throat> Like I said, you're the last one. But as above, so below. <laughs> okay, Libra? Doesn't matter if you were first or last, my darling. Anyway, um, Libra, this is for lovers only. Okay, so this is Libra, lovers. And as you can see, we have everything spread out for you, my darling. Let's go ahead and dive right on in. Libra. Well, someone who is uh, your Ten of Pentacles, okay? Ten of Pentacles is someone who is your wife, your family, uh, someone who you love, someone who is your lover. Uh, after they walked away from you with the eight of uh, chalices, everything was just left up in the air between you guys. I mean, things that... Y'all should have said to each other, y'all didn't say, you know, the, the words and, and the feelings that y'all felt for each other uh, was just left in the air, okay? And also, they left because your relationship was stagnant. There was, there was just no, nothing really happening for you guys, okay? So, they just went ahead and walked away. Now, this person is may, has made a choice uh to be your lover okay so they walked away from you and things were left unsaid between y'all but now they want to come back and express how they feel with the queen the Nesuit female ruler of chalices okay they they want to show you their sensitive side they want to show you their loving side their that they're devoted and they want to be devoted towards you okay because you know libra they, they made you feel left out in the cold baby they made you feel like you know you had to feel the harshness of these hard streets alone you know just living by yourself and no one to keep you warm at night no one to you know love you you know you felt as if this person didn't love you because they didn't say anything like that and at when they left they didn't express any kind of feelings it's, they just went ahead and ran away like you know they didn't care about 
you they didn't care about your relationship your marriage or your or your union okay and they also juggled you libra okay this is a two of pentacles baby they juggled you they juggled you and another person that was another reason why they left and another reason why uh or because things were stagnant they went ahead and got themselves another lover but even though they got themselves another lover with the six of chalices they were nostalgic about you they are nostalgic about you and they are coming back to express what was not said between y'all when he or she walked away okay and after they do this or before they do this they're very jittery very anxious and and sad you know because they don't know what is going to happen they don't know what is going to be the outcome of you um hearing from them again okay because you know you, you had a very beautiful union even though there were times when things were stagnant and and up in the air and you know you didn't express your love for each other okay because and that caused them to to go ahead and and, and uh juggle you and somebody else and walk away but now they want to come back you see this person is walking away this way but now they're coming back this way to express that love and devotion and loyalty and you know now they want to be loyal because they wasn't devoted or loyal to you in the past to be juggling you with another lover they want to come back and tell you that they love you that they're very nostalgic about you that they have very sweet and and you know loving memories about you okay but and and they're very sad about what they have done or they know that they made you in this position of being sad and, and feeling unloved libra but they, they're coming back baby they're coming back and they want to they want to express like i said they want to say the things that were left unsaid and they want to become your lover again my darling now here is the uh, Love Oracle Cards 3. I shuffled about a hundred times and I pulled you these, baby. Okay. Leaving space, Libra. Now here's what it says, baby. It says, uh, give yourself time to heal. Right one can't come if the wrong one is there. Clear a drawer for them, okay? So this person walked away from you. So that left space for you to have another type of energy come into your life, Libra. Somebody who is healed like you're healed or healed to at least a degree where they feel that it's okay to come out of their cocoon. Okay, this other person that is coming towards you now, Libra. Okay, this person... uh. You have to clear a drawer out for them. That you have to clear a drawer out inside of your mind, inside of your soul, or even if they're moving in your home. Clear a drawer out for them to be able to move in there. Or if they have their own place, you know, uh, still clear a drawer out. Give them a drawer for when they come over your house, okay? Give them a place to put their things so that they feel uh, welcomed in your home. Because you know what it feels like, Libra. To not feel welcome with this five of, of pentacles. You know what it feels like to be hurt and feel left out. And you don't want this person who you have to leave a drawer open for. And this new person coming into your life to feel that way, baby. Now here's the second card you got is investment. It says, see if they're the one. Spend time together. Make effort getting to know them. Uh, emotional investment. Okay, so... You Like I said, you've been feeling left out, no one loving you, okay? So now you have to see if this new person that you had to leave space for because somebody has to come and fill this void that you're feeling, Libra, okay? If this person is not here now, uh, they will be here soon. They perhaps will come after this past lover comes back into your life trying to, you know, express their love for you after they cheated on you with another person. Okay? One moment. <coughs> ah. Excuse me. 
<laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> anyway, Libra. Now you, you want you want to invest in somebody who is not going to have you in the five of chalices position, who is not going to walk away from you and have things left unsaid. Even when this person comes back, you're gonna to have to face them and tell them that you know you're not interested in investing any more of yourself with them because if they could just walk away from you and leave your union like that, baby, they can do that again. Mr. or Miss Fix It. So it says, don't try to fix others. Heal yourself to attract best partners. People pleasing. Trust the process, baby. So, yeah. Don't try to fix this other person or this relationship that you were in in the past. Just because this person has decided to come back and want to be your lover, Libra. <clears throat> I mean, my goodness, as, as beautiful and amazing as you are. Libra, man, <laughs> you're such an amazing energy, such a balance of energy. Like, it's like your energy is just out of this world. You know, it, it is amazing. It is amazing. I've, I've known a few Libras in my life, like, like my stepfather. He was a Libra, you know, and I say it was because he had passed away this uh this February. And, you know, he's somebody who just can never be replaced because... It's like, uh, it's unreal. I know the candle just went out <laughs> when I talked about my stepfather because, you know, it's a very, it's a very painful thing for him to be gone out of my life right now, Libra. So I know when uh, this person comes back and try to bring you love that you or that they are going to feel very sad because you're not going to accept their love. You're going to have somebody else come into your life who, when they walked away, made space to come into your life, okay? And, you know, when they're not going to get you back, yeah, they're, they're going to be very upset. Because this person who walked away from you, uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, uh, is a very sensitive person. A very sensitive person and they shouldn't have done what they've done to you Libra they shouldn't have had you out there feeling like you were not anyone worthy of their affection or of their love baby okay they shouldn't have had you in that energy but now that they had you in that energy you gave yourself the time to heal so that the right one can come in and by the time this person comes back into your life, baby, the right one may already be there. And you are trying to invest in this person with an emotional investment, Libra, that you want to be balanced with this person and love this other person and let this let your ex, let your ex go, let your ex go and, 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 you know, feel the loss of you. Okay. Let them do that then my darling <clears throat> because they will never get over the loss of you baby now here's the secret language of light transmission from your soul okay now i shuffle about a hundred times and i pulled you this card is variance okay variance so that says to me right now there's a lot of a variety that is coming your way libra why didn't i turn to the page page is number 39 <laughs> Okay, it says the differing perception of ego and soul. Mm. So that's saying that, hey, it could have been their ego that caused them to walk away as well. But let's see what it says, Libra. It says today, you may not feel like yourself. You and your soul are looking at the same thing, but are seeing it differently. Okay. So when this person comes at you, you and your soul are going to look at him from a different perspective or her, okay? Now it says, your emotions and reactions are a combination of your thoughts and your soul's thoughts. And when they don't align, you feel wobbly. Variance is a way of explaining the wobble. When you have the same perspective or the perception as your soul, uh things feel right they may seem satisfactory and easy no limiting beliefs or patterns are triggered but there is a feeling that all is well 
Your soul will not join you in judgment, blame, or hurt. Because it is not the truth of you. It is not the perception of love. Okay, how you feel reveals how aligned you are with your soul. If you are experiencing something that doesn't feel quite right, take a breath, come back to your center. Come back to your throne, Libra. You will begin to feel better, inspired, to navigate your inner radar and ready to receive your soul's transmissions. Okay. Yeah, so, you know, that, that tells me that, you know, your soul is going to guide you here. Your soul is going to guide you here, you know, because you may see them when they come back into your life and they may look really good, but your soul is what's going to guide you here, okay? And going to take you to another direction away from this person. You know what I'm saying? If you follow your soul as opposed to your ego, your ego is the thing that sees somebody looking good and sounding good and smelling good and having all types of good things. You know, they have themselves together and whatnot. That's what your ego looks at. Like, yeah, this person may make me a good partner. However, your soul is looking at it differently because your soul was affected by this person when they up and left you for another person. Or for something else. Okay. So my darling. Listen to your soul. Follow your soul. If someone has come into your life baby. And that you know. what That was you know, being left space for. Then invest into this person. Not the ex person. Let your ex go. Let your ex go Libra. I think that's why I would title this. Let your ex go. Okay, leave them alone. They're, they're not good for you. They're a cheater. Or let the cheater cheating ex go. <laughs> something like that. I'm going to name it something like that later. Okay. <laughs> anyway, my darling, let me go ahead and, and I'll bring this to a close. Let's see how it well, It's like going on 16 minutes now. My darling, like I said, just listen to your soul. Follow your soul. It will never... It will never misguide you, okay? Your soul will never misguide you, but your mind will. Your mind will. And your mind will misguide you because all kind of different thoughts are coming and being transmitted to your soul from all types of different people who are thinking all types of different thoughts that go up into the daggone atmosphere and then circle around the galaxy or the universe and come back to you and you think this is your thought, right? And you don't know either what disembodied spirit may be speaking to your mind and making you think this or think that. When it comes to a romantic relationship, a loving relationship, you listen to your soul. They tell you to make a head over heart decision. Well, your soul also has a mind, okay? Your soul also deals with thought. Your soul also is intelligent enough to guide you like your mind can guide you. However, your soul is deep, is deep and has to be utilized in relationships the problem is people keep using their head and don't want to feel their way through this feel your way through this libra and feel this person who is coming into your life or has come into your life you know make an effort to get to know that person and make an emotional investment in that person because the universe sends you this person for a reason and that reason is, be is because you were hurt. So don't allow this person to come back into your life and hurt you again. Libra. My darling, that's all I have to say. I love you. You know I love you, Libra. That's why I'm saying all this to you, honey. Peace, love, and light. <clears throat> Until next time, Libra. Bye-bye.